shower I just finished lotioning up um so I want to do my hair first so I could like kind of like have my edges done and sitting because if y'all y'all know my edges don't lay they don't they just they just they don't they don't lay and I was gonna take my hair out but I'm not ready to take it out yet I want, um, oh, I haven't had it up so long. Oh, yeah, that feels so good. Um, I gotta wash my hair. My hair is, like, disgusting. But I had it up for so long, like, the tension feels good. But I'm about to put it right back up because I have no idea what I was going to do with my hair for this photo shoot like I've already had how many photo shoots I've had with this hair I've had two I think the beach shoot in Delaware then I had um the power shoot in this hair so like I'm running out of ways to style it so I think I'm just going to put it in the top knot bun and just like but like a very strict bun like not like a messy bun like i've been wearing it but like a strict bun because i actually wasn't even planning on shooting today like i got invited to this networking mixer for like models and photographers but when i got invited i got invited because of my agency i was going there to recruit models for my agency but when you buy the ticket the guy that recruited me he's running the event and He's, he was so nice and he, he saw when I was at the other event that I was an agency owner. So, you know, networking, he invited me to this event, his event, and he's a photographer. So he sent me the link for the tickets and stuff to support. I bought, there were like two types of tickets. It was a model or photographer. So I was like, oh, I guess I have to just buy the cheaper ticket, which was the model ticket. But I didn't plan on modeling because I, I said I was retired and I mean, my mama told me to stop saying I'm retired, but I feel like I feel my mindset is like I feel retired, so that's why I keep saying it. So I'm like, okay, I just buy the model ticket and just show up like my, my little business suit, you know, to pass out business cards and recruit and all this other stuff. And I get tagged in a photo that says I'm shooting. Like, shooting with the photographers. I'm like, whoa, wait a minute. I think I was mistaken of what my position was going to be at this thing. Like, I thought I was just going to, like, you know, be a bystander. Nope, apparently I'm going as a model, and I'm actually, you know, shooting with the photographers. And I'm like, well, I can't back out now. But I definitely was not prepared to shoot. Uh, so I'm trying to put this up in like a, looks like some of the hairs in the back are short. So it's like really difficult. I might have to just bobby pin them because I don't think they're going to stay. Okay, so now I think this is gonna be a tricky part. So for this part, I got the rubber band. And then I think I'm just gonna like twist as many times as I've had a hairstyle like this, like I should be an expert by now on how to style this, but I'm not. So I'm just gonna take, I don't know what I'm doing you guys. 
and then this one keeps falling out. I might just have to pin this up. I'm just gonna put that right there. But yeah, so now I went to the mall and I hate shopping, y'all. Like, I went to the mall to buy a whole outfit, spent like a hundred and seventeen dollars on buying this outfit. I knew that was gonna happen. I spent like $170 on buying a new outfit because I'm supposed to be shooting fashion in boudoir. And I'm not a boudoir model. I just don't, I don't necessarily just do it. Like I don't have a problem with it, but that's just not my thing. I always feel like I'm not really good at the whole sexy thing. Like when people say I be taking sexy pictures, I'm like, how? Because I'm like the most awkwardest sexy person like you'll meet and i don't know how i'll be putting off these sexy photos because <laughs> that ain't me baby okay so i think this is a good base to like <laughs> like i said i don't know what i'm doing i'm just trying to get it to like stay in a bun form okay so now i think i just take bobby pins i'll be back okay so guys this is what we got it's a little lopsided <laughs> but guess you don't care <laughs> me so i'm just gonna put this scarf i put the gel already on my raw edges i'm not worried about actually swooping edges i Y'all know I don't really, I haven't been really into that whole edge look thing. So I just slick them all the way back. And I'm just going to put this on the edges to keep them down. Oh, I have so many bobby pins in this bun right now. It's not even funny. And I'm going to take this off in the middle of doing my makeup because, um, y'all yeah, know I got that scar on my forehead, so I definitely have to make sure. I covered that up. Okay, the scarf is on. I keep finding little pieces that keep like sticking up. And I'm not keep trying to use bobby pins in this thing. Like I just wanna keep it. Like I'm gonna bring my bobby pins with me. It is like lopsided. But we don't care. Now it's time to for me to do my makeup because I don't care. Yeah, I don't care. Okay, y'all, I'm back. So, I don't even know what time it is. Hold on. It's 2.55. The actual event starts in five minutes. My goal is to leave here by 3.30. And I'm actually going to try to do a, a actual look. Like, not my usual natural, glowy, lazy, glam look. Like, I'm really going to try to do an eye look. We have a flawless beat, all that. Not like that, that quick stuff I be doing. So... You guys know I usually don't use primer. I just like make sure my face is nicely moisturized. But and I also don't even have that much left in here. Is this tube like empty? <laughs> um, but I think this tube is empty. Yeah, so but I only put it in like my T-zone anyways. And I had this primer for such a long time. But yeah, so we're going in with that. I wanted to take my nails off so bad, but, and they need to get redone, but from far away, they still look good. Far away, they still look good. But I was like, since I found out I was shooting, I'm like, let me uh keep these on and try to keep these on. These lasted a long time. Like, shout out to my nail tag, Tempted Nails. Tempted Nails by Tumi. Tempted Nails Instagram, check her out. But if you in the Maryland area. So this is gone you already know i'm going with my go-to foundation you already know um i still have some of my old foundation left and i don't know when the next time i use that because it's kind of like technically empty but i hate wasting stuff so i guess a day where i don't really have anywhere to go i'm gonna wear it because uh yeah but yeah so I pick a random fashion outfit on my closet. I'm supposed to be shooting a fashion one and shooting um, a Dewar. 
I'm going to show you guys the outfit later. Um, it's cute, but I really need to get back into the gym because your girl is letting herself go. And I really have no excuse. Like, I'm not... Like, shout out to my thick girls that look good thick. Me? Mm-mm. Because I'm unproportionate. I'm unproportionate. So I got to get my shit together. Oh, oh excuse me. <laughs> Sorry for my language. All right, y'all, I'm back. I just did the whole vase um, because y'all know I had to... Y'all know what I do. I don't switch up nothing. And <laughs> so far, looking good. I'm going to take the task card off because... Uh, it's decent. But I got to blend out that area. Um, so I won't look crazy. Uh, but yeah, so... I cut my nails on for this event. I didn't even do my toes, but guess what? There's a solution that it's called closed toe shoes. So your girl will be wearing closed toe shoes for today's photo shoot. And who's gonna clock me? Nobody. Absolutely nobody. But so far this is what the face looks like. I have to hurry up and set it. So I'm about to hurry up and do this so I could do my eyebrows. Don't know what time it is. I'm gonna check that after I do this. Okay, it's 2 18, so am I gonna be done in 10 minutes? <laughs> we'll see. Okay, I set my face already. It's time to do the eyebrows and scar wear. Scar wear. I do need to stop playing around though. My goal is to get there before four. I know I'm gonna do that because it's not that far from my crib. Um, I've been doing this new thing with my eyebrows, and I just got them done. Holla at me. Um, but I'm starting to, like, not be satisfied with just using the pomade I usually use for my brows. And I just had to go in with eyeshadow, too. And I know it's not a new method, but I've just recently did that on myself. Oh, yeah, yeah. So I recently did that myself, and I'm like, hold on now. This slaps. This slaps. So I'm gonna do that method again and actually, you know, be precise with it because I was obviously in a rush. I did car makeup. The last three times I did my makeup was like car makeup, but it still came out good. So I'm gonna go in with this and I'm gonna outline my eyebrows like I usually do. You see how it's outline, right? Now I'm going in with black shadow to fill it in. Watch, watch. I stand by what I said before. This laps. As far as eye makeup, have no idea what I'm doing, but I'm probably going to go dark. Yeah. All right, real quick, you guys, before I change it to my first look that I'm actually shooting in, I'm going to pack my second look and some stuff that I'm going to need. So I think it would be helpful for you guys to know, like, this is a quick shoot and it's not that far. So this is what I would pack for this particular shoot. And since I'm only doing two looks, the one I'm wearing, which I'll show you guys afterwards, and the one I'm shooting in, I'm going to show you guys first the necessities you need for something like this. Now, anything you need for your hair. For me, I probably just need some bobby pins, a brush, a small edge brush, and some hair ties. So I keep all that in here. Lotion, body oil. Girls, you know. You know. Deodorant. For me, this is a must. Like, I don't like smelling myself i don't like smelling other people so this is not just for you but for yourself for other people that might need it never catch yourself don't don't let nobody catch you slipping don't catch yourself slipping deodorant wipes wipes guys wipes is trust me like trust me now if you especially if you like on your cycle stuff like that and make sure you have your cycle products um whatever you need for that some spray i always keep my spray in, in my cycle products in my purse just in case you never know when you need them and makeup wipes you gotta have your makeup wipes and anything you need that will might mess up your makeup like eyelash glue lip balm lipstick whatever you use for your lips and your eyelash glue now for my second outfit that stuff that i'm gonna need so i'm gonna start with my accessories i keep my jewelry in this plastic bag and all i have is some nipple covers 
because I can't reveal the outfit just yet, guys. Some earrings and a waistband. I also am wearing some lace gloves with that outfit as well. So I put that in the bag. And the actual boudoir outfit. It's giving grandma boudoir, but I am a grandma at heart, so I love grandma boudoir and see-through. That's why I need nipple covers. Gotta make sure you have that. And the shoes. The new shoes, guys. New shoes. But yeah, so those are stuff that I'm packing for the second outfit. I'm gonna get changed really quick and show you guys the outfit of the day. The Aqua Marines in this cute pink apple two-piece set. You guys, this is to die for. I know y'all gonna get into this fit. Like, like, well, let me scoot y'all back some. Get into this fit. Hold on. Ooh. Check out the jewelry, wrist, ring, ears. Okay, now it's time for me to skedaddle. I'm gonna film more when I get there, y'all. workshops in the DMV. Uh, so our main goal is to bring a community of both fashion and boudoir uh, photographers and models together to create a platform where we can have a safe environment where we all can create. Um, so if you're watching this, hope to see you at one of our future events. You got anything, Ram? Thank you for showing. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed this get ready with me slash mini vlog. Please stay tuned for the next video coming out. I know I've been MIA, but I promise I'll be back. Thank you guys so much. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Mwah. Deuces. Peace out, home slice.